Due to the forest that we live in, the members of the Sholo Fire Department are all wildland certified. Every year, our firefighters go through a recertification process to make sure we are physically able to fight wildland fires and are up to date on the latest wildland firefighting techniques and equipment. Our wildland crews have been called up to fight wildland fires in many states across the nation. As our community grows, we feel that it is necessary to familiarize ourselves with the commercial and personal property that makes up our fire district. Pre-planning is an important process that helps us to know where there may be hazards, exits, suppression systems, utilities, etc. This helps to ensure occupant and firefighter safety. These pre-plans are input into the system that when printed out, they enable us to keep copies in our engines for easy access, therefore aiding in suppression efforts. Our firefighters spend a lot of time mapping street addresses and hydrant locations to keep up with the growth of our community. This helps ensure a quicker response and the knowledge of the nearest fire hydrant. Fire hydrants are required by ISO to be tested once a year for adequate operation. These tests are coordinated through our department and the city of Sholo. We here at Sholo Fire Department feel that fire prevention and education is our top priority. October is National Fire Prevention Month. We spend that time educating all of the children in our district, which is approximately 2,700 children. They are sent home with information to eliminate fire hazards within their homes and develop exit plans with their families. It is important that the children understand that the firefighters are their friends and are there to help them. We do this by letting them become familiar with our turnout gear and equipment. The Sholo Firefighters Association raised the money to purchase our Edith trailer. This teaches children exit drills in the home. It demonstrates home fire hazards and simulates fire escape procedures. We know of three families that have been saved because of the things we have taught their children. The Sholo Fire Department is the Regional Hazardous Materials Team for Navajo and Apache County. The majority of our firefighters are certified hazardous materials technicians that have gone through a 200 hour class to get certified. Our department participates in various hazmat drills and goes to a number of hazmat calls every year. Due to the large portion of our calls that are medical responses, all of our members of the Sholo Fire Department are either emergency medical technicians or paramedics. We receive medical direction from Summit Healthcare Regional Medical Center while performing on-scene patient care. We further our certifications with refresher classes, run reviews, and in-house training to have the most current education for medical services in our district. We also have drop-in blood pressure checks available to the public. At the Sholo Fire Department, our on-duty crews train daily. We practice minimum company standard drills, where each shift is timed on pulling hydrants, pulling hand lines, and flowing water. We also participate in many other drills, like the latest techniques on saving a trapped firefighter, extrication, and EMS procedures. The Sholo Fire Department members are timed to make sure they can get dressed in their firefighting gear and on air in less than a minute. This is just some of the many drills that we practice. Here at the Sholo Fire Department, we take great pride in our station and equipment. All of our facilities are 100% maintained by our department personnel. 
The daily routine begins at 8 a.m. and is continued throughout the day. This includes station, equipment, and vehicle maintenance. Daily engine and equipment checks are required for legal and safety reasons. Those checks also include hoses, SCBAs, medical supplies, etc. Doing this in-house saves the taxpayers money. We believe that our employees are the greatest asset to our department. To ensure their safety in this physical and mentally demanding profession, a wellness program is essential. As community members, we are reassured to know that our first responders are healthy and ready to assume the challenges that face them daily. Our firefighters are required to participate in mandatory physical agility and endurance testing. They must be fit for duty because losing a firefighter is unacceptable. The firefighters are required to participate in physical training. Statistics show that our call volume continues to increase as our community grows. The Sholo Fire Department is dedicated to improving and providing the best service for the needs of our district. Station 330 is out at the Sholo Airport. There are members of the Sholo Fire Department that are certified aircraft firefighters. This is another certification that must be updated yearly with a flammable liquid live fire and hours of training to keep up to date on aircraft construction, fires, and extinguishment. The Sholo Fire Department has recently established a full service fleet shop where all the Sholo Fire apparatus have been able to have local immediate service from a certified emergency vehicle technician. Our fleet service mechanic comes to all first alarm fire calls to be available for any apparatus issues if needed. The fleet service for Sholo Fire is currently the only emergency vehicle maintenance shop in the White Mountain area and is servicing many of the other departments and their vehicles in the surrounding area. We work for our citizens in the Sholo Fire District. It is important for us to be out in the community not only to provide our services but to get to know you. We kick off National Fire Prevention Month with our annual open house. This is our way of thanking the community for the support it gives and gives you an opportunity to get to know the Sholo Fire Department. We also participate in community events like our local parades. Fireworks. Sholo days. Fundraisers. And many other activities. Group visits from the public and station tours are always welcome. The most common answer you'll get when asking a Sholo firefighter why they do the job they do is to serve my community. In closing, all the employees of the Sholo Fire Department would like to thank the community of Sholo for the opportunity to serve you.